Wow. Um, where has all of the time gone, right? All, all good things must come to an end. So at this juncture and before concluding, all right, it's most appropriate to obviously thank our guests and all of the, those who've participated and supported the running of these uh, sessions over the, the, the academic year. So it's been an absolutely fantastic 19 weeks since we commenced this series earlier on in the academic year, 19 weeks, 19 guest lectures, which means 19 guest lecturers. They bring in together like a really vibrant mix of speakers um, from across the full spectrum of design and engineering, just looking at the, uh, the kind of logos and the kind of companies and people and institutions I've been working with, like a mix of leading practitioners, organizations, opinion leaders, radical thinkers, and emerging talents that have come in and spoke to you guys and, and hopefully inspired you guys as well. And highlighting the diversity and breadth of roles from the fields of design and engineering, like we hosted guests, including the global project manager, and telecommunication engineers, all the way to like assistant designers at globally uh, renowned luxury fashion brands, and from CEOs and founders and self-taught engineers of rocket and launcher startups, all the way to kind of highly qualified electronic engineers who have worked across the medical IoT robotics um, and presently femtech industry as well. From those who run internationally popular podcasts available across Apple, Spotify, and other podcast channels, providing a service to communities in design and engineering to senior award-winning service designers with offices based across Europe and the UK. From patent attorneys helping others protect designs and intellectual property rights, all the way to, um, to NHS nurses and business people, helping business owners position themselves to attract funding and protect their mental health and well-being as well. And if we've noticed over the weeks how many of these disciplines and sectors overlap and then across the different roles, responsibilities, skills and outputs, from those like who are recruitment specialists, all the way to industrial designers that provide emerging talent with feedback and folios and work, assisting in the process of their potential recruitment and employment. Those working in research, innovation, and at some of the world leading suppliers of robotics, uh, plant manufacturing and system technologies, alongside those who develop meaningful experiences and services with an underlying narrative and technology to inspire underrepresented um, communities in the STEM subjects as well. For those with over 20, 25 years of experience in their respective fields, to those who are up and coming emerging talents who have either recently graduated from master's programs or undertaking PhDs alongside their industry experience as well. From those who are CEOs, partners, founders, co-founders running their own companies, startups or side hustles, right? To all of those who work for like multinational mass media and entertainment and conglomerates. Those who are senior visual designers at huge international brands and companies, to those sharing tips and advice in visualization and rendering, helping those within the design and design engineering communities, really diverse, but at the same time, there's lots of overlaps, lots of similarities. Many of their advices also overlapped or concurred, cementing and reiterating the various perspectives, advices and takeaways over the course of the academic year. Not only were they diverse in their role and sectors within the, within the actual disciplines as well, but also in their geographical locations, in their backgrounds, in their journeys and in their stories. Like nothing develops intelligence and experience like travel. Right? And like the past year has been unprecedented. It's different, sometimes really difficult for many of us. But without a doubt, the global community and the global family has been able to connect in ways unlike before. Like uh, the numerous Zooms, Skype, Teams calls and meetings that you guys are all now very familiar with. If it also facilitates a lot of opportunities. And likewise, whilst we run this particular series on campus in like a really massive lecture theatre, many of you guys in the final year would have uh, experienced this previously as well. We've been able to connect with fascinating people across the world, across continents and time zones. This year, whilst all of you guys was, were at home, either in the UK or wherever you guys may be, feel free to drop a, a line in the chat telling us where you are at now or where you were before. Lots of our guests joined us from across the UK, across Europe, the Far East, the Middle East and even the USA. Right. So we'll take this moment just to thank all of those who joined us and gave their time. They shared their stories, their advices, their experiences, their expertise. And hopefully they left you inspired. So all of those are from Belgium, Ruta Riesens, from China, Jan Smeschkal, from Finland. We had Laura Lokanen and we had Alicia Defosse. De from Germany, we had Veronica Zumpa. From Lithuania, although uh, during the talk, he was actually based in the Azores Islands, Antonas Bernatonis. From Singapore, we had Simon Gwaz. Uh, from Dubai, we had... Anam Aziz from the USA, we had Tyler Sinat, and from the UK, coming back home, Rabia Arif, Adam Shaw, Anna Bulls, and Philip Slingsby, 
Sander Valk, Bradley Harper, Dr. Alex Zivanovic, Wynne Griffiths, Sam Grilt, and Shruk Al Attar. And from all of us at Middlesex University, product design, product design engineering, and design engineering, um, thanks to all of the guys and thanks to all of those who have um, made these uh, lectures possible. And we look forward to obviously staying in touch with them and working and with them again in the near future and hopefully hosting them again um, once uh, things return back to normal. So guys, feel free to visit the Central Notion page. It was, it's also been sent through in the chat on a weekly basis. It's on your module pages on my learning as well. So this comprises of resources from the talks, all the audios, all the podcasts and full videos where permission and um, where it's been possible. All of this is available there alongside any shared resources, slides, links, etc. So feel free to check it out. And just to conclude, guys, uh, alongside our gratitude to all of the amazing and diverse guest speakers, we'd also like to thank all of those who like continue to support the series, sharing the weekly emails with the relevant cohorts and those who helped out with the brainstorming and in initiating contact with the speakers. For example, Pro Professor Mehmet, Kate, Wynne, Alex, a huge thank you to all of you guys. And not forgetting, guys, a huge thank you as well to Talk Vidas. Talk Vidas is a current placement student at Goodyear in Luxembourg. He spammed my inbox at the start of the academic year with lots of his enthusiasm and suggestions of speakers alongside his like uh, avid networking and putting me in, in touch with people he also connected with as well. So thank you, Talk Vidas. And for all of you guys, if you have any recommended speakers or associates interested in giving a talk, feel free to drop me a line at any time. For all of you who are in your final year, feel free to join the audience in the subsequent years uh, in these talks as alumni from next year onwards. And we look forward as well to hearing from you guys and one day maybe your stories and experiences and journeys on this platform. And last but not least, guys, a massive thank you to all of you guys who've attended. You've participated and engaged brilliantly in all of these talks. You've listened really attentively. You've taken notes furiously, even after a full day of studio sessions and lectures. And you've asked lots of amazing and brilliant questions. So thank you to you guys. Just to finish off, we wish you guys all a lovely break. Good luck with your final assessments and stay well, stay safe and best wishes to you all. Um, can I also thank you on behalf of the whole department in terms of how you coordinated uh, these talks and the fantastic hosting that uh, you performed on every occasion. Fantastic. Thank you very much.